I did some weird stuff. Yeah, me. I did some weird bogus stuff. Bye squad, what's going on? Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my channel. If this is your first time here, welcome. My name is Nayel. Make sure you press that red subscribe button down below and press that bell so you don't miss it the arrow bows. Hey sis! Hey y'all! It's a sister day. We twinning, but we not twinning. We got on different colors. <laughs> so we both have on the Cali sweatsuit. Make sure y'all shop now. And um I'm a bubble gum today. She look like a piece of booty delicious bubble gum. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she has on the pink okay. one, I have on the tan. We was this close to being twins, like this close, but she really didn't want to be my twin. So she like We twin two years ago. So she got on the pink one. Oh, that reminds, let me take this out of here, girls. She don't have on a life as well, too, but I, I did get it for her. Have a life I, had, I only got the one, and I just wore, um, when did I have it on last week last when week. I came to your event? Oh, my God. I got so many compliments on that. But you got a color I don't even got. That green color? Mm-hmm. Well, I, I really pink. like that. It's like a pale green. But that charcoal gray was really cute. Mm -hmm. Um, Kyra. You know what? Does she watch on YouTube, girls? You don't watch YouTube like that, do you? No more. I stopped watching My YouTube now. girls got me into this. Everybody was eating them, talking about you're going to get addicted to them. The kombuchas, right? The kombucha and mm -hmm. those pretzels right there. You need to try you like pretzels. Them? Oh, they are. They're okay. They're okay. You guys them. You might not like it because you just ate them other chips. Oh, hold on. Let me my teeth. Hold on. I thought oh. you would like these better. It was something. Wasn't it something you had got from Trader Joe's or somewhere you said was addicted? Mm, Y'all had the, these pretzels. It was, the, um, it was the granola bites. Oh, like, and I ain't care for those. You got well, them too. Because my, my mom was like, I seen Brittany and I got them. She was like, they wasn't all that. <laughs> what? I see. I love them things. Or I could have got a bad bag because you know it's hit and miss sometimes. Because one time I got my little cookies. Because I'm addicted to their little tiny chocolate chip cookies that are in them tubs. Yeah, these are bad batch one time. They was like stale or something. Y'all like these? Let me know. I'm addicted to those. They're right. So good. Mm -hmm. that one and good they're thing, really good for you. Look at the... Um, Mom, they're not good for they you. They have two grams of protein, no sugars, no added sugars. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm addicted to the um to the apple chips. The apple chips? Apple. You know how they got like little fruit chips? But they got the red apple chips. They are so good. I'm going to I'm gonna have to bring some. From where? I got them, I got them from Walmart. Them from I Marcus. found them in like yeah. the little... I think they just fruit before. chips. They like fried up fruit. Ew. No, but it's so good. Like, I only eat the apple ones. I don't do the bananas and all that stuff. But I like the banana ones, so I probably would like the apple ones. Yes, I love What made you try them? Um, Somebody had them? My coworker, my hygienist had it. And she was like, you should try these. So I like to eat them with my turkey, my turkey um, Slim Jim. Mm -hmm. I tear them turkeys. What? Up. They are so I gotta stop good. with the cheese because I eat the because <laughs> they come in a pack, you get the turkey Slim Jim with the cheese. Uh -huh. And I've been eating that for like lunch at work. It's a good snack though, right? Mm -hmm. I be tearing them six up. Mm -hmm. With my apple juice. The turkey chomps from Trader Joe's are so good. Y'all, we done been to Gage. We went to Burlington and now we're at Old Navy. We are literally running. We are literally all over the place at stores. Now I'm about to try on these cute little cargo squishy pants. And this cute little green, I think this would be perfect for vacation. Let's see what it's giving. I grabbed a small and a medium, but I put on the mediums first. I don't know, they look good. They're kind of big. I'm gonna try on the smalls. They're kind of big. And it's not tight around the ankle. Um, uh, let me see how the small, what the small is. Yeah. Yeah. Like this is good. I need to get them all to. <laughs> yeah, I think the small is definitely it. Yeah, the small given. But if I get, if my legs get any bigger, so it's up. Small. 
it is. We are done shopping and running errands. I'm really the one who had to go to a couple shops, and it seems like everybody needed something from Old Navy. Your face is bright. Um, some tanks. Essentials. Old Navy was having a really great sale and they got some cute little essentials. We got some tanks for eight dollars and now we're going to get our massage and facial. Yes, finally. I can't wait to get this mm -hmm. these kinks rubbed out my back. And these pores sucked out my skin. What kind of facial are you getting? I'm getting a hydro facial. A hydro facial. Yeah. We'll give y'all the review afterwards. I'm not going to the same masseuse that I went to last time because Lariah is not there today. So hopefully whoever's doing me, it is a girl. I just don't, I, I don't, I wouldn't want no man rubbing on my body. Mm -hmm. Oh dang, oh well. We're here. First session, you get a TikTok. I am. <laughs> Follow me on my TikTok. Follow Brie on TikTok, what should you do? Right. Brick Sharia. Who is Wendy? Let me shut this up. At five in the morning, I wake up to five on my yard. My massage was pretty good. It wasn't the best massage I ever had, but it also wasn't the worst, and it wasn't at the low end. It was on the like higher end. And I thought my, oh my god, <laughs> I thought I was pretty cool too. I look crazy. Hold on. <laughs> Did it hurt? No, but I can tell that. Honestly, be honest. No, I know, but you know how like when you do a, a facial and they massage your chest part. Yeah, and your little neck. Yeah, and back. She was really going strong arm, so strong hands on that. So I can tell if I was getting like a full body massage, she would have hurt me, and I would have been upset. So I'm so happy I'm not into massages. Oh my gosh, she was saying deep tissue. I said yes. She was getting the crooks and the crannies out. That's why I said what was her name because Alyssa was pretty good. She was real cool too. Like it was a silent appointment, but she did check on a couple of things with me and i was like yes girl she says it okay because it was when it was starting to really get serious I said, mm -hmm. <laughs> when it was starting to get serious it was getting serious <laughs> it was starting dang to and she messed up my baby hairs and stuff mm. i don't even got the right baby hairs no more <laughs> all right let me put in crafty crap oh, i'm ready to chow down y'all about to see this <laughs> <laughs> I haven't been to crafty in a while. Oh, I'm ready to get crafty and cracky. Well, how you spell it? Is it any with a K? Huh? Or is it with a C? C. Uh oh. Crafty. Here you go, crafty. Well, we really need to do a little hooky hook when we get in the house. You got the stuff. Hookah is bad for you. We should just drink wine. All right. When the hell do you. Because you know what, I'm gonna send you the same. I'm, let me send you something. Just give me a sec. Let me see what I sent Kiana. So, I'll, so what you threw everything away? I didn't throw it away, but I just don't think it's the best for us to be doing. Watch Any this. More? Yes. Listen. Watch this. Hopefully, it connected. Atlanta has a hookah problem. I'm sorry. What's wrong with that? Mind you, I live in LA. I've been there for a decade. Ain't no hookah out there. Yes, it is. Word. <laughs> in no the sense that you would go to like the Mediterranean spa or the halal spot. Yeah. And then you could do hookah at night. They give it to you with like milk to make it smoother. Mm -hmm. They put like the fruit around the you rim. You know what you're talking about over and there. And it's the, it's the shisha. Yeah, shisha. Yeah, the shisha. Which yeah, is shisha. like the, the gel yeah. tobacco. Mm -hmm. But they're not giving you shisha. You're getting regular tobacco in that hookah. And it's not um, the coal. They're supposed to come around and tap that coal every few, you know, 30 minutes to tap off all the soot. So next time when y'all go do hookah and you pay attention, they're not doing that, but the and coal is getting smaller and smaller. It's going through. No, so it's, so no, no, it's not. It's going in the air. That too. So like if you're in the, the hookah spot and your throat is burning, yeah. when you go home and you blow your nose and see how much mm -hmm. soot is in your nose, it's so unhealthy. Yeah. And then you're not supposed to be smoking out the plastic. 
Because that plastic, all the microplastics is going in your throat. It's supposed to be a wooden mm -hmm. nozzle. Teach them. So I'm just like, y'all not doing, y'all are doing spooka. I just don't like the fact <laughs> that there's no hookahs in the clubs in L.A. Because it's not supposed to be inside. It's supposed to be in the club. <laughs> no, it's not supposed to be getting, indoors. You getting your vibe. If you do it correctly, it's always outside. You, it's not supposed to be. Mm -mm. I'll be scared to smoke hookah that outside. That hookah is. I'll be on my patio like, man, if this thing. Listen to her big one. I feel real loose. Me and Britt saying we might take our hoodies. I might. Have to take, you got shirt on today? No, I don't. I might have to take this off, y'all, and get into the food when it comes. Yeah, she might take my phone. I can't even record. Y'all just hurry up. Do it real fast. Strawberry peach lemonade. That's a cocktail. That sounds good. I should record. I should do a TikTok too. I still gotta put a TikTok together. I just ain't edited it yet. Strawberry peach lemonade. That might be good. I'm gonna try that. Can you say hi? Leave a little looking. Leave a little looking. Check it. I wanna see who boy who be. Um. Snow crab legs, shrimp headless, the boom. You getting yours? Fire. No, I get mine mild. Okay, I'm gonna get medium. You're not gonna get medium. It's mild, medium, fire. Oh, I thought it was medium. I meant mild fire. It's a mild, medium, fire. I thought it was mild. Whatever the next, the not the hottest one. Yeah, I'm gonna do medium. I'm gonna take one of this one. It's a lot. Okay. <laughs> That's fine. Cause I don't want a whole thing. I just do one of those. But where the little extra you can add in there? I don't see the egg. Yeah, and I the need egg, the egg. The egg size. The size. You see? Oh, boy egg. Y'all mm -hmm. give me two boy eggs. Thank you. Yeah, I'm gonna do the bricks. Y'all, Brittany hurt because he didn't ask her if she wanted salt or sugar on her brand. And she don't got it. Thank you. I don't like lemon in my water. It's not in a cute cup. <laughs> she said, did she get a Shirley Temple? Why is it in that cup? This is a margarita. When do y'all ever see a margarita in a Because Shirley the Temple bar cup? is not supposed to be open. But why'd you get a whole mason jar? You should have got what I got. This is a lemonade. You know lemonades come in these kind of cups. Ain't this cute, y'all? <laughs> I'm pissed. Now I'm about to taste that. Let's we'll see how it tastes. Hold on. Let me pour <laughs> So, oh, you know what? I'm just gonna do a TikTok to y'all. Let me get on my 10 minutes. Hey, y'all. So, at, on a date, kind of nervous. <laughs> <laughs> I'm with my sis. Say hey, Britt. Hey, y'all. We at Crafty Crab in Wilmington, Delaware. I got a strawberry peach lemonade. Let's test it out. Mmm. Mmm. It make you want to do that. This is good. Let me taste. You gonna want to get that. <laughs> she act like she don't like it. You, it's the peach. It's good. Oh. Strong? I'm not getting strong. You gonna, gonna think mine's the child. Let me say strong. You gonna really think mine's the child. Yours probably strong. It's all light skin. Mmm. It's a child. Is no, they probably using the same bottom shelf liquor. It, it is the same color though. That was good though. It wasn't bad. Oh, I can get a couple of these. Not with my ass in the mid passenger seat. <laughs> That's just how we roll. Oh my gosh, it takes a lot for me to get lit. This is not my birthday. <laughs> I had Don Julio. Don Julio going to do it every time. 1946. No, I was about to say, I thought it was 1946. It's not Don Julio. It's not the expensive one. It's 1942, yeah. not Don Julio. It's just tequila. No, yeah. 1942 going to do it every time. Y'all, the food is here already. I got to take my shirt. Y'all had to take my hoodie off. I had to get comfortable. The food is here, okay? You got to shake that going up, get all the sauce. Yeah, yeah. And then we got some sweet potato fries. 
Do they good. In the things? I don't do you. No, but people say that's what you're supposed to do. I guess that makes sense. But I be, um, but I want you to do it. But I guess we're not, we're probably going to eat it all. Thank you. Mmm. These so good. I got one right here. You be putting gloves on? Yeah. You ever put them on? You put that bib. You put the bib on. You know it's about to get burnt. That's just how we roll. You know what it is. Huh? Yo. Y'all bring really got a lot of crap. She got two pounds worth of stuff. I don't know what to do first. I'm gonna do a shrimp. Huh, take your two little shrimp. Don't ask for no more. Cause you got way more than me. Y'all gotta dip it in there. Dip it in the sauce. Yeah, get you some, get you some. Mm. Bon appetit. It's so good. Ten out of ten. Always will recommend. Ten out of ten. Always will recommend. Another one. Dip it in the sauce. Y'all see that? Y'all see that? Mm. Ten out of ten. Potato time. Dip it in the sauce. Come on, bite, bite, bite. Mm. I see that. Y'all see that? Mm. Y'all was talking to TikTok, but I'm talking to y'all too. Here you go. Mm. I don't even eat the yolk. I don't eat the yolk today. Yeah. You gotta get that on your TikTok. Y'all, almost done mine. She got two pounds. I got one pound. Yeah. I'm on to my second egg. Bon appetit. <laughs> Too good, y'all. I ain't had this in a while. Look at that. This is real good, though. It's so good. Finito. Crushed it. Call me bone crusher. <laughs> crab crusher. We have some stuffed crabs. We got the ideas. Let me put my earrings back on. Yeah, I had to get comfortable. I took my earrings on, off in my hoodie. Let me put my hoodie on first. How you feeling? Satisfied? Yeah. We so satisfied. I just don't have one in my car. You don't have your cord? Because you could plug up in my car. Why is your phone not charged? You didn't charge it back? Oh my gosh. Is yours, is yours kind of warm? It's, it's not warm enough. I'm not. <laughs> I'm about to snap. Oh, wait, wait. Hey yo, put my joint in the yeah. oven. <laughs> so we went to crumble y'all just for this cookie, and it's not even warm enough because they had it mm -hmm. sitting out. Why would you? Oh, we were supposed to cheers. Cheers. Mmm. Right. Mmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Is it good? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Icing really so. Mm hmm. I'm not icing. Me either. I'm not an icing girl either. Okay. Y'all better do that. Give me a little swig of water real quick. Mm. Not the chocolate on my bubble gum. Mm hmm. Y'all, yeah, it's Monday. And my face is doing that allergic reaction stuff again. Y'all see like this red, this red patch right here? It's like itchy and it's like a little swollen now i don't mind this this little pimple came yesterday but mother nature is about to come as well 
anyways it's a new week it's a fresh start so we're conquering it and of course in monday fashion that alarm went off and i didn't want to get up even though i went to sleep early i didn't do much early i didn't do much yesterday i was literally like just lounging in the house for the most part but it's something about that monday energy that was like mm, be lazy don't get up i snoozed my alarm but as you can see i did not let the alarm win i got on up it's time to go hit the gym and get serious about the body goals okay you know we're always serious about the body goals but like you know i had to i had to do like basically my month of eating my carbs well eating my rice and I'm still eating my rice. However, <laughs> I'm trying to get my content, y'all. That's what I'm over here. I'm still eating my rice because I got to finish my brown rice. Yeah, now I'm going to get back to my fruit and meat real soon. We just got to eat what we got first because we not wasting no food around here. I want to just snap my fingers and just have lipo and the perfect bod, right? Don't Isn't that what we all want? Like, to just snap our fingers and have the body we want? Well, that's not real life. Unless you got the coin in the downtime to do whatever you want to do. Y'all still been taking my zinc and my magnesium at night. I've been taking my zinc, like, when I eat my first meal of the day. And I've been taking magnesium at night. I believe the magnesium has been helping me sleep. And I pray and hope that this zinc has been supporting my immune system. I haven't been sick since the last time I told y'all I was sick. I did have a little tickle in my throat, y'all. Last week, one day, I was like, ooh, I don't like it. It was hurting a little bit when I swallowed. I woke up. It felt better. I gargled Listerine. I wasn't playing. It ain't come back. It ain't come back though. So I have on one of our older sets. Two piece, super cute. Giving tie dye a little bit. This is the top. The buttons keep popping because y'all know your girl has little watermelons in there. But this is how it goes. This is the back. And I just paired it with a light fit jacket. This is literally one of the first jackets of the collection because it has the full light fit out. So these are the first ones. Now all the light fit jackets have the little light bulb. Let's go to the gym. Hey y'all, good morning. It is the next day. It's Tuesday and I'm on my way to the gym. It really be like pitch black outside. Ooh, the birdie. It be pitch black outside. Y'all, so like my truck, when I brake, my brakes be squeaky. Now the last time I got an oil change, which was a little while ago, I was telling them that and they was like oh no that's because you got the best brakes he was like yeah our brakes are like the best and that's one con they like are squeaky but you won't have to change your brakes for like so long and I'm like that's a little embarrassing because if I pull up on people if I'm around people and I'm breaking and my joint squeaky they're gonna be like damn sister girl needs some brakes okay but y'all don't care about that anyways I was just checking in and bringing y'all in my little born old life because i don't really have anything going on this week y'all besides this past weekend that's in this vlog i don't know what the heck i'm gonna be bringing y'all along on because oh they need to slow down let me take off skirt they was beating y'all it's four in the morning they need to slow down slow down <laughs> It was coming. It usually don't be that many people out on the road this early in the morning. But yeah, like I was saying, I don't really have much going on. So I don't know what I'm going to show y'all. I don't have no packages coming in. Your girl is your girl is just like super boring and regular degla this week. 
Well, I probably should show y'all my Saturday outfit. <laughs> it's Tuesday, but I know what I'm wearing on Saturday already because I'm going out with the girls, going on a girls' date. I'm always doing something, ain't I? But I don't be doing nothing during the week, but being intentional about being around the girls. They asked me out on a date. <laughs> It's like, nah, the girls that I'm going out on, going to dinner with this Saturday, we've been trying to get together since December. It's going to be March once we get together. That is how busy everyone's life is. And not even busy, it's just like we're grown, we're adults, and we just have stuff going on. It's not like somebody is busy all the time. It's just like if I got this going on this weekend, but they got that going on that weekend, and homegirl got that going on, her son got that going on, and she in school, something, something, something. Like, you know, like being adults, the schedules be busy, and we just could not get together in December. January didn't work. So, we going into March, but at least we found time for each other, and that's all that matters. Period. So, make time for your girls. Check on your girls. Everybody is in a different season of their life. You know what I'm saying? So, friends that you felt closer to at this season, friends that you felt closer to that year, two years ago, everybody's in a different season, and that's okay. I just feel like as long as you're checking up on your people... That's your duty to check up on your people. You don't got to hang out with everybody. You don't got to do what you're doing with this friend that you do with that friend. You don't got to do what you do with that group of people, with that group of people. You have your special relationship with the people you have your relationships with. You know what I'm saying? And it's a season when you might be hanging with that person or doing stuff that, with, with those group of people. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's life. That's what adulting is. And that's my little TED Talks. At 4 o'clock in the morning on a Tuesday. Check in on your people. That's all. I feel like that's all you obligated to do. Is check in on your people. Let them know you love them. Pray for them. And keep it pushing. That's all people can really ask for. You know? That's all I ask for. I don't ask for much. I check on you. You check on me. I'm going to be praying for you. If you know how to pray, I hope you're praying for me. <laughs> and that's about it. See y'all later. Here's my thank you cards came in. So I ordered from this company, Moo. My brand manager um, told me about this place. She said she really likes how they do their cards. It's so cute. They got all this cute packet like packaging. Forget clickbait. It was cute. And then they, this is even cute too. Fill your inbox with gold. And then what else they sent? They gave me. You're awesome. You're as awesome as cold milk after chocolate cake. So cute. They better do their branding job. But life it is going to be issuing uh thank you cards with uh our packaging now so it might be a little late to a party but i told y'all i'm figuring it out as i go along so this is a front light fit and then this is the back your order made our day blase 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 pause if you want to read it or just order something and you'll be getting a thank you card from light fit listen i'm just working on bettering the brand every day every week every month every year trying to get better with time did y'all notice that i took my lashes off it was the lash clusters though i just took, i took them off last night i was messing with my eye and like bloop 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 i don't have nothing going on until saturday so we can give a little boy until then i put my jamaican castor black castor oil on them and the lashes are doing good they are thriving and striving can't even lie I am back from the gym, y'all. It's Wednesday, and I'm about to start washing my clothes, dividing my clothes into piles. And while I do that, I'm going to listen to some praise and worship. I've been in my bag all morning, praising the Lord. Um, so let's listen to some music and wash some clothes, okay? Searching for someone who was someone who will...
tell y'all i've been working like a slave i've been working like a slave uh i knew today was gonna be busy though however i need to make my food i need to eat something all i had about 45 minutes ago was some darn grapes i need some substance i worked out today Ugh, so handy dandy air fryer i love this thing if you don't got one you need to get you one it's just so fast, quick, easy, and efficient however when i was doing the meat and fruit diet which was really the red meat and fruit diet I didn't use my air fryer and I know some people make their stuff in an air fryer like their beef patties their steaks I never did because I felt like it would dry it out I have to try it though I'm gonna give it a try this next go around so I am about to make me some fish I'm making me some smoked fish salmon smoked salmon I'm gonna show y'all how I season it too so y'all can see how I season and eat my salmon and if you want to try out the seasonings, try it out. I think it's good. And then I'm going to eat the rest of these. Wait. Oh. Oh. Dang it. Dang it. I'm going to eat the rest of these wing things. I'm trying to eat up all my white meat. So I can get back to my red meat and fruit diet. I'm going to go back to it, y'all. All I'm going to try to do it all the way to, until May. That's the plan. And I got another thing. Of, I got ground turkey in here. I got to eat. So I'm trying to eat all of that up so I can start stacking up on my red meat again. Supposedly, people said I had good results. So we're gonna, we gonna try it again. But I will add a little, like I'm gonna add rice. I think I'm still gonna add like the brown rice on Tuesdays and on Fridays because that's the days I'm working out the biggest muscles of my body. And well, not the Monday. Tuesday for sure, because that's leg day. And then Friday we do glutes. So you want to activate those muscles you're trying to build on those days. So I think those are the days I'm going to add some brown rice. I'm tailoring this to my body. I'm not saying this is the right way. This is the only way. These are things I'm doing and implementing because I tried it before. And I've also just been talking to multiple people. And that's what this is all about, y'all. It's a lifestyle. You have to try everybody's body is completely different my body is different from your body what works for me might not work how it worked for me for you so you have to try different things out and that's what i'm in the process of doing and i typically put aluminum foil down and season it on the aluminum foil you can just put in your air fryer but i don't like to do that i like to minimize the mess i like to kind of just make some cuts in here and then a turner and I cut her the other way. This is to help her thoroughly cook, in my opinion. This is all my opinion, y'all. I ain't no chef. I like to put, if I don't have fresh lemon, I like to do my lemon juice. Less mess. I sometimes put pesto on my salmon, but I'm a little tired of the pesto. Yeah, I'm tired of it because I don't be tired of stuff. Some black pepper. I overdo the black pepper on everything because I like black pepper. <clears throat> I'm using very, very good garlic by your girl. I Aunt Tabby. This is good too, y'all. Sprinkle her on there. Flip her over. Get that side. Flip her back over. You know the vibes. And then I put the regular stuff. Garlic powder. For the sake of time, I will flip it over after I show y'all everything I put on here. Adobo. Adobo. You don't have to. I feel like you don't have to go onion powder. You don't have to go heavy on your salmon with seasoning. Just a little sprinkle dinkle. Okay, is that everything I want? I like to put a little Obey. My camera's about to die. I like to sprinkle some Tabasco. I don't know why I keep using this one because this is the one I'm supposed to take when I 
pack my lunch and stuff, but whatevs. And then a sprinkle winkle of slap your mama because I don't like my stuff over salty to be too much sodium. Sodium. I don't know if I'm getting old or what, but that is what that the front is gonna look like. And I'm gonna cut a couple pieces of butter and put that on top of it in the air fryer. So all right, this is her, y'all. I'm gonna put her in and I'm gonna show y'all when it's done. We are going to go over to the fish start and we're gonna push that time up to like 23. not gonna lie one of my favorite things about working from home is being able to make my food fresh when it's the things that i like to cook fresh so my steak beef and fish i would rather not have to warm that stuff up in a microwave i like to cook that stuff fresh it's nothing like warming up fish and you stink everything up and then it just don't, it just don't give. I feel like it'd be fishier the next day. That's just me though. My second thing I love about working from home is like being able to wash my clothes in between meetings, real quick breaks, just throw a load in, throw it in the dryer and you done. And that third thing I like about working from home is my outfit. Like fuzzy socks, my winter PJ pants and a black t-shirt because you see me from the neck up. Black t-shirt, you can never go wrong. When you don't feel like dressing up, you don't feel like putting nothing on, throw on a black t-shirt. It gives professional. It gives clean. It gives sleek. And with the Zoom filter, child, you'll be just fine. This is how I'll be on the meetings. Yeah. Ah, oh, my God. <laughs> when you're making fish in the house, especially in the air fryer, it is essential to light a candle and maybe crack a window because you don't want the house smelling like fish all day i got this down packed though because y'all know i make fish a lot so like that candle i need to put my key downstairs and i'm about to go crack a window because i almost forgot i started smelling the smoke come up the steps that smoke in the sand okay okay i'll be back when it's done i'll be back when it's done <laughs> y'all is done can y'all hear it mmm that looks so scrumptious and I really can't even eat it because man, I love it. It's nice and crispy around the edges and on the top. Come on now. Oh, it's playing in my face. Y'all see this? Playing in my face, but. Oh, my mouth watering. Scrum dilly. Scrum dilly umptions. I just wanted to show y'all the finished product. Let me get back to work and I'm going to come back and eat this. Y'all, I'm so pale. It's giving Casper the friendly ghost. Hey y'all, it's Thursday and I did some weird stuff. Yeah, me. I did some weird bogus stuff. And let me tell you what I did. I had the audacity to allow my car to get to no gas. <laughs> I've done this once before, but I literally rent like was going I went straight to the gas station. This time, this is my thing. I usually get gas on Sundays. I didn't get gas on Sunday because I didn't leave out of my house um, last Sunday. I didn't I didn't leave out of the house. Um, so I didn't get gas where I normally get gas at. This week, I didn't go nowhere but five minutes from my house back and forth every day to the gym. Today is Thursday. I went into work. Mind y'all, I always typically get gas once a week on Sundays. So my gas ain't have that much. And to be honest, I don't know my car. Y'all know how y'all know your cars? I don't know my car. I don't know how long my car is going to last on no gas. So I'm I'm nervous. So I'm just really um, asking the Holy Spirit to sustain my car. I know he works through me. I don't know about my car. But, you know, I'm just praying to God that I can make it to this BJ's to get my gas y'all and i don't know my car the light but the light came on like when i tell you this drone say empty do y'all see it's nothing there it's not even a little orange mark down there it's just nothing that whole thing should be orange and my gps done got me getting on the highway i put my gps on because i want to get to bj's the fastest way possible and bj's is on my way to my mom's house where i'm going i could have stopped at any other gas station 
and then I was like, I know, I know the air conditioning takes from your gas, but like the heat don't, right? It's cold, so I had to put on the heat. And I'm just like, don't want to have to pull over or break down on this highway. I really wanted to take 13, but it's more light. But it's also more opportunity for me to get gas. And I just don't know how it's going to go. So I'm going to update y'all. Update y'all. So I'm here at the BJ's, right? I don't understand why it's a god dang mother freaking line. I can't. Oh my God. Are you serious? This line is like a, come on lady, go ahead, go, I'm sorry, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, I got to get gas, I ain't got no gas, sorry, God, dang, it ain't your fault, I know it ain't your fault, ain't nobody's fault but my own, but this is ridiculous, it's a Thursday, like, it ain't like it's a Saturday, Friday after work, Sunday, why is this the line, y'all, this is the line, come on, come on, come on, man get about my video okay he got he got earrings in both his ears you better mm, you know what he like y'all this the line i gotta get all the way up there i just drove 11 16 minutes to get here and this is what it looked like lord i pray this go fast because that would be so embarrassing for the car to just stop in the middle of this line and the people be like dang we should have let her go first but we gonna see we're going to see, child. I was just trying to run here on my lunch real quick. I got to me a call at 2 o'clock, and it's 117. I might have to push that bag because I need to get gas, and it's going first. At this point, this is my livelihood. I need to get gas. Oh, my gosh. I got to call at 130. I thought it was at 2 o'clock. This is what I got to go. I got to go. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Jesus is so good. So freaking good. Okay. I'm getting gas now. I am filling up, child. I am filling up. I hope it go fast because I got to go. But just wanted to update y'all. We good. With my mom, y'all. Hey, Say hey. We are about to go get my little cousins. I haven't seen them in person in a little while. So they should be excited to see me. But we will see their reactions in just a moment. Here. Well, this isn't the welcoming response I was looking for. Oh, the babies is sick. The sick. Listen, I can't get sick though. I can't get sick. I might need to keep my distance. But honey, he is not feeling it. Here, you want this baby here? Oh, He's sick. He like, who are these people? The poor baby. Well, I'll see y'all when we get the other two. I see you. I see you. You peeking? You trying to see me? Hi. Hi there. Oh, 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 oh my gosh. Now, why would I do that? <laughs> why? Good thing his sister. <laughs> I said, my son. <laughs> mom, hurry up. My mom went into the school to get the girls. Oh, it looks like they're about to come out. It was my fault. Hey, girl. Hey. 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 Well, hello to you, Deviana. Huh? Well, hello Hi. to you. It's okay. <laughs> I haven't seen you forever. <laughs> you have a cutie. You say hi to the squad. Hi. <laughs> These are mine. Yes, they are. Wait, that's mine. Huh? That's mine. Is that one yours? I don't know. Huh? What are these? What's in here? That's yours. Oh, it's a cup. Oh, I'm tired. What is it? It's a cup. What is it shaped as? Huh?
laughing. He bagging up laughing now. I said, oh, you bagging Hi. up now. I know. He like, I do not know you like that. <laughs> Look at him. Uh -uh. You see your um things you can take home with you? Yeah. What's that? Wait, is this mine? Yeah, cups? you can take those home. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, let's go play. Your mom says she's doing it now. I made some spaghetti, so I'm about to eat some spaghetti, but she made ours a little healthier. What, are, what kind of noodles are these, Mom? Uh, bonza chickpea. Oh. These are bonza noodles, which are chickpea noodles, which is a bean, right? Is that yes. a bean or it's a it's pea? It's a pea. No! It's a pea. And why is that healthier? Because it's made out of a bean instead of a... Uh, it's a bean pasta. noodle instead of, like, Beans. flour. Chickpea. It's definitely a different texture. I don't mind. I really don't. But it's a healthier option. And y'all know this is my last week before I'm about going back to my meat and fruit. So now we're friends and he's calmed down. And we're getting along. I let him watch Bluey on my phone. Eat some applesauce and things are good now, right? We're friends now, right? Right, we friends. You tell them hi. I am friends with my big cousin Nye. Oh yeah, update on food demolished. How about these? How about these? They all nasty and slimy. So unexpectedly, oh my gosh, oh my gosh! Let me switch all up. So I've been telling y'all for the past couple days, I'm going back to my meat and fruit diet. So I ran in Aldi because my girlfriend was telling me that they actually have grass-fed beef. So look what I found, y'all. New York, New York strip steak, grass fed period i this is my first time ever seeing it so i got this pack and this is a pound and a half i got ribeye steak grass fed this is a pound and 19 mm -hmm. and i got two ribeye two ribeye ones and then i even got a ground beef so yeah i got all of that from aldi y'all so, Aldi do got the stuff. I just feel like I went on a Thursday night. Like, going on Sunday might not be the best to go. Because that's usually when I do... That's usually when I do my food shopping at Aldi on Sunday. Because they don't be open on Friday morning when I usually do my Walmart run. And we're going to go to Walmart tomorrow morning, y'all. I'm going to take y'all in. we actually going to do some shopping. Because I got to get some stuff. And I got to get some different stuff that I don't usually get. Yeah, so I just wanted to show y'all what I got from Aldi. Good morning, y'all. <coughs> It's Friday morning. It's 4.45. And I'm about to just fill up my Stanley cup. Because y'all know I'm a wet Stanley girl. Filling up my cup. About to go to the gym. It's booty Friday. Ow, ow, ow. That's because I shouldn't be doing it. It's booty Friday. So I am about to... Work on these glutes. I would have made it to the gym five days this week. And there is potential that I'll be going to the gym tomorrow morning. Possibly. If they decide to have it at my gym in Middletown. It would be like a circuit class. I haven't been to it. They did it a couple times in a woman's gym. But your girl was not there, okay? It was in woman's gym. You get me? So. <laughs> so, happy to have made it five days this week. Feeling very productive. Feeling like, you know, the body, the body is bodying. <laughs> no, for real, I am feeling good. Oh, I was about to say, I left a light one around the corner. Feeling good. I'm so happy it's Friday. Like, this is my first full week of work, I feel like, since this year started. And it's been massively long. I don't even think those words go together. It's just been extremely, it's been an extremely long week. Work has been extremely busy, but 
But the gym has been keeping me afloat. Like, so thankful to have this outlet. And that's why it's so important to have some type of outlet. I'm talking to y'all and it's 4.47. I gotta go. I'm gonna see y'all when we get to Walmart because we're gonna do some shopping together instead of like a haul. I wanna kinda shop with y'all through the store. Squad, I just left the gym. I'm feeling good. Y'all, it's March 1st. It is the first of the month. And to be completely honest, come on. <laughs> trying, to steal, trying to steal my shine. <laughs> um, and to be completely honest, I am so motivated. I'm feeling so motivated this month. I've been feeling really motivated this week. Like, I've been feeling really motivated, really good about, like, the gym, getting back on track. Not that I really fell off, but y'all know, like, after I did the free fruit and meat diet, fruit and meat diet, January, the month of February, I wanted some darn, I wanted more carbs, I wanted, I wanted rice and all that. And I always feel motivated. But something about this week, and it's the first of the month, you know what I'm saying? I'm feeling real freaking good. And some, something amazing is going to happen this month. Because something good happens every day. Because every day the Lord is waking me up. And that's a blessing in itself. Because that means he's not done with me yet. There is still something I need to complete for the Most High God. Okay? But all seriousness, for real. So it's a blessing every day to wake up. Because some people do not have that that blessing they don't have that privilege especially to wake up with the things that i have and the roof over my head my family love all of that but i'm excited so if you didn't complete the goals you wanted to complete in january and february we in march now i know they all try to say don't don't wait to the first of something or when something wraps up but it is the first of something it's a fresh month even if we you just in the first week of march it's another month to try to check those goals off, meet those goals, start assigning yourself new goals to meet if you've already met some of your goals. You know what I'm saying? Make your goals bigger. Like, make your goals, like, unreachable so that you know it's only through Jesus himself, the Holy Spirit, that you could attain and reach those goals. I know I am. I know I am, okay? Period. We got a lot of cool things going on this month. I'm excited. I'm also excited that I have definitely been sticking to my self-care this year. Every The past two years, I did not stick to my self-care consistently. But February, January and February, I did. I already booked some self-care plans for this month of March. It's at the end of the month, but that seems to be when everything falls. So I'm a month out. And I'm, I'm happy. I'm checking goals off, y'all. I'm sticking to my vision board. I'm sticking to my goals. And I think you should, too. All right, y'all, so I'm in Walmart so far. I'm gonna grab some of these. I haven't got these in a while, but I do like them. I got three of these. Y'all know every week I get my green apples, so I got five of those. I wanna get some grapes, but the grapes last week were not all that. They were not, and they didn't restock them. They usually stock them Friday morning. I'm not sure why they don't seem freshly restocked. These actually don't look too bad, so I'm gonna grab these. All right, now I need to get my mangoes. But like I said, they don't, they did not restock their fruit this morning. Hey, okay, Rihanna. Y'all, I got me a pineapple. Cause pineapples are really good to eat, y'all. Pineapples and watermelon are like one of the best fruits to eat because it's really like water, to be 100% honest in your system just for you to let y'all know i'm getting these small trash bags for my bathroom why is it open that's walmart for you i i right now i think i have one more left but i have the pink ones from glad they don't have any pink ones here or i would have got the small pink ones but i do got that's the big not, pink ones give, give. okay this was something on my list Get a reliable 5G network and unlimited I need to y'all I need to get a whole new Swiffer mop John. Yes. Because mine broke. And I need to mop my floors. Oh, what's this white sauce spray? They got a new one. Mango hibiscus. 
not gonna do it because I just bought a new spray. Y'all yeah, remember that spray, the Clorox spray I got? Okay, so we need a Swiffer. Okay, they're over here. Like, this is such an adulting moment right now, buying a Swiffer. I don't know which one to get. Power mop wood. And why they don't got the prices on it? Because now they're playing in my face. This is me looking at the Swiffers. Did they get new Swiffers? Yeah, I don't know what to do. I need my mom. Okay. All right, let's be for real and try to check this out. Okay, they got the little the little bonus drawn. Sorry y'all crooked, but that's how the way it's fitting in my bag. I'm shaking it to see if it comes with a joint already. Oh, yup, it do. It come with a power mop wood quick dry joint. Okay, batteries included. We got batteries. Lead light, fine mist spray, five times cleaning powder. Okay, so we're gonna get this. And this value size, do I need value size? I don't think I need value size. Okay, that come with eight. I'm gonna get the, the regular drum. The five drum. These go with the power mop. Okay. I mean, it come with two refills in the mop already. So should I just get that first and then next week when I get paid, I'll get some re-up stuff. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get the regular Douglar. See, they don't have the regular Douglar mop that I used to have because I had the Swiffer wet jet. I didn't have the power mop, but I think I need the power mop. So we're gonna get that. Okay, that was just such an adulting thing. I feel like I did. Oh, look y'all. Remember the Lysol spray? They got the little disinfectant spray drawn too. The hibiscus drawn. I ain't gonna do it. Mm -mm. I'll wait till it gets summer and then I'll try to get a little fancy. It's raining, raining. Ooh, baby, it's raining, raining. This is me, y'all. This is my energy at 6 o'clock in the morning after the gym. Hey, I get the spring water. Y'all know this by now, though. I think I want to get eggs this week too because that's another thing that I can eat on the fruit and meat diet that I didn't do last time. So maybe when I want a snack or something, I could just boil two eggs because I do like boiled eggs. I just haven't really been eating it. I haven't ate eggs on a regular, like cooked them myself in a while because I don't really do breakfast. I think I need to re-up on my butter. Do I? I think so. So, I just want some unsalted butter. Where's the cheap stuff? <laughs> because y'all know I'm cheap. No, I don't wanna, I can't believe it's not butter. I want butter. Make sure I keep an eye on my, my cart back there. Okay, okay. This is $3.98. Yup, you could give me the um sweet value the sweet cream butter. Why I gotta say that though? I just want regular butter. Okay. We'll get the breakstones butter. I used to get um I used to get the, like avocado oil butter and stuff and they like don't do that basically okay now let's get some eggs 
you can get 12 large eggs for $3.58, but for less than 40 cents more, you can get 18. So what's giving get the 18? So we gonna get the 18. Why is it not clear? Okay, yeah. So we gonna get the 18. That makes more sense. Do y'all pop y'all eggs open to make sure ain't none cracked? That's like an old school joint, right? Like everybody cracked their eggs to open them up to make sure. This is why you open them up to make sure they not cracked. That joint right here, she cracked. And I would have never seen it because it's covered up by that. Nope. That's so funny because that's only the second time that ever happened to me. But I need to make sure. <gasps> Yo, I just dropped the egg on the ground. I literally dropped an egg on the ground. Look. Gotta go. I gotta get out of here. Okay, I'm almost done with the food part. I'm just getting one of my favorite snacks. Can y'all guess what it is? Where am I at? My favorite last week I didn't even eat them all I end up wasting two but it's okay now I need to go get me some exfoliant I'm a crest 3d white girl it really keeps my teeth sparkling on top of the 3d crest mouthwash do I want arctic fresh or do I want glamorous white I think I like glamorous white. This is glamorous white, then they have like a deep clean one. What's the difference? Is there really a difference, to be honest, in these stuff? Who knows? Okay. Y'all, I love toiletries. I can't wait till I have to shop for toiletries. Coming soon. Oh, this is so cute. They have the miniature EOS ones. Why don't they have my favorite? Which is the purple. Oh, it's start coming out. Oh, this smells good, though. That smells real good. I wonder if Walmart's going to be in for a rude awakening when Target is open down here. I don't think so, though, because I'm still coming to, Tar to Walmart. And then I'm going to go to Target afterwards. So I'm over here in the Hydro Boost collection looking for a exfoliant. Okay, so they have a Hydro Boost with Hyaluronic Acid Exfoliating Cleanser. Gentle ex gently exfoliates while boosting hydrating for instantly soft, refreshed skin. Dang, I can't open it. I want to see, like... Is it really exfoliating? Cause I need to I need something for my pores. My pores are big on my face. And I need them to go away. Well they barely have any in stock, so maybe it's good. I'm gonna try it. I wanna get some star face patches so bad. And they have different colors. They're so cute. They have pink ones. They got black ones, green ones. But my thing is like I haven't been getting like big pimples and they like $11 too much not gonna lie I love that it's light outside because it would usually be dark when I got back out here it's 6 38 in the morning it is usually dark so loving that for me so y'all know I just been a bad got my mop y'all I've been down bad without a mop for a little while I was borrowing a mop but the days of borrowing are over. <laughs> Your girl needs a mop. <laughs> okay. Ugh. I usually fit everything in here. One of the best purchases I ever made was that LD bag. That joint fit a lot. Very, very good quality. My eggs. 
Now my eggs, y'all know I done went through three eggs to find the perfect egg. All 18 eggs are cookable. And the guy that came over, he said, you found the right one? I said, yeah, the rest of them had cracks. I said, and then I made a mess. And he said, don't worry about it. I'll get something, I'll get something to cover that. I said, thank you. My, my eggs ain't make it in that bag because I can't get no cracked eggs. Now, the worst part about Fridays is when I got to take two, three chips because I got five, six of these drones. All right, home we go. Hey y'all, good morning, it's Saturday. I just popped on here because I'm about to go to the gym. This is my first Saturday workout of the month. I mean, it is the first Saturday of the month, so that makes sense. My bun is a little combobulated, but I'm about to go to the gym, it doesn't matter. So yeah, continuation of this vlog next week. So make sure y'all tap in and check in. If you're not following me already, make sure you tap that subscribe button down below and hit that thumbs up if you liked the video. And comment, talk to me, let me know what y'all think, like what y'all like, what y'all didn't like. You know the vibes. So hope you guys have a fantastic week, have a positive mindset and try to check off those goals that you have set for yourself, period. And y'all make sure y'all be the light wherever you go. Because wherever you go, the light shall fall. I love you guys so much. Bye.